heart and soul of the game is at the boxing voice. Ain't no other sight in the game to see the boxing voice. All right, boxing voice here with La Bomba, Edwin Rodriguez. I'm um, here at the Leheba Tuck Hard. First off, you're, you haven't had a fight this year, and you got one coming up this month on the 23rd. Can you tell us a little bit about that um, and how you feel coming into this year? I feel great. Um, I'm fighting. Um, I haven't had a fight yet, but I'm, I'm ready to go back on May 23rd. Uh, NBC, PBC. It's my first fight with, um, with the PBC series, and I'm really excited. Uh, I want to thank Al Heyman for giving me the opportunity. Um, I want to, you know, I'm coming in here with, with a, send a message to all the light heavyweights. Um, I'm ready and, um, and I'm hungry. You know, I'm fighting an undefeated fighter on Craig Baker on May 23rd. And uh, I've just got to go in there, send a message, knock him out, and, um, you know, get ready for bigger and better fights. Like uh, I won um, Pascal, um, you know, Adonis Stevenson, and uh, Kovalev. You know, those are the big names in my, in my division. And um, I need to send a message to let them know that I'm for real. All right, uh, now that PBC is making other power moves and they're kind of going on their new networks and such, uh, what's that transition been like for you as a fighter going to them and uh, working with this new kind of uh, movement that's happening in boxing? Uh, you know, I'm excited. You know, it's a, it's a good thing for boxing. It's a, a boxing and free TV. Uh, you know, it's bringing us to, uh, instead of um, a million homes like HBO and Showtime is doing, they're bringing us, um, you know, two, three, whatever the numbers is, but it's given us a, an option to uh, have regular uh, fan follow us more and uh, build that fan base and um, and stuff like that. So I think that um, it's a good thing. Uh, Heyman is doing big things and I'm excited about it. All right, and we know you had the setback, especially with the weight. Um, uh, how, how much did that affect you having to squeeze into the weight, like this with, with Ward, for instance, um, you know, and, and couldn't wait, but now that you're up at 175, but how, how did that affect you before you made this move? I, you know, uh, I'm not going to, uh, you know, talk about um, something in the past because, you know, I don't want to discredit uh, uh, Andrew Ward on a, on a good win. Um, you know, I think that um, everything is part of, of boxing. Whatever you do outside of boxing, it, it shows in the ring. And, um, you know, I was in, uh, I didn't do everything that I needed to do to be able to make 168. It was extremely difficult. But, um, you know, he did his job. He did everything right, and, and it showed in, in fight night. I lost the decision to Ward and, um, you know, wish him the best and hopefully down the road I uh, get my name on 175 and maybe hopefully we could do a rematch or so. But as of now, you know, he was the better man and he deserved credit. Well, it, that'd be kind of hard to do with the politics, seeing that now he's with Rock Nation. But you did rattle off some, some interesting names that you could probably get into after you dip your, you know, after you get your feet wet here on the 23rd. Um, so what are you going to work on? What are we going to expect come 23rd from Ewa La Bomba? You know, being explosive, um, I feel like I already have my defense and my offense put together and I just got to uh, go out there May 23rd, be explosive and uh, you know I think that um, Craig Baker is a good fighter, he's undefeated. I got to take that away from him and um, you know show everybody that I'm a real um, I'm a real power player at 175 and I'm coming for Stevenson, I'm coming for Kovalev and those are the fights I want. All right, and uh, last question. Now, you, you, you want those two guys, and, you know, they're under the same umbrella, uh, uh, you know, with PBC. So um, how realistic and how, um, you know, how are those talks with Al Heyman and, and the Al, uh, PBC management about making fights like that? Uh, is that is that already being talked about? Uh, you know, uh, this is my first fight with NBC. So my, my number one goal is to go in there and, and look impressive and um, have, have, have them put me as a priority. And um, you know, build my base, build my my stuff, and then um, get a fight against Stevenson. And um, you know, I gotta build myself up. It's a new weight class and everything else. So I gotta prove that um, you know I'm I'm as strong as I'm as good as I was at 68 at 175. All right, I mean, you've been off for a while. Any last words? Anything you want to get off your chest to the boxing fans out there listening in? I'm excited. Uh, thank you, all Heyman, for giving me the opportunity. NBC, PBC. It's on, man. I'm excited, and, and we're going to go to work. All right, Rob Box Boys, appreciate the time. Thank, Thank you. you